What is going on guys today? We have more content, another guaranteed pack, the first one of the summer heat. Obviously, this was in the code a couple of days ago. I think it was yesterday morning. Uh, Footwatch obviously uh, announced it in there. And that is the player moment and team of the season moment, SBC guaranteed. So, I, I don't know. I know they did this last year, I want to say, with flashbacks. And for someone who collects the cards, it's not great for me. Because predominantly, I have most of them. Realistically, the only ones I don't have is like Lucas Mora here. Um, and I don't know if there's actually any more. We got um, Jota there. And realistically, I think that is about it. Oh, and, and a Ramos, I suppose. Sane. But realistically... Oh, Hazard. Hazard would be a nice one. Realistically, I'm going to get them at some point. Team of the Season moments won't be at all good for me. Because I have all of them, realistically. I, I literally have all of them. I've not given any up because they are the better versions of everybody else. So... Realistically, player moments, any of the SBCs that I haven't done are great. And as you can see, an 84 rated squad. Um, obviously, headliner Walker we packed recently in an 82 to 88. So that's not a problem. And then we did get an 86 Gundogan. Everything here is untradeable. So I've got it all to spare. We are grinding through the 82 to 88s. And yes, I probably could use some of these players more for another SBC, for a prime icon, for something like that. But I thought, you know what? We'll bring the content. I always like to, to try out these SBCs. And you never know. If we end up with a hazard, with someone like that, then we've kind of made it a little bit, if you get what I mean. But big risk with this one. For me, I don't think it's worth it. I think an 84 is pretty decent. Like, you can get a lot of decent stuff from the 82 to 88 and the 81 double. We also do have a foot 14, which I believe is from foot birthday. Um, you get a two rare player pack and a premium gold. Um, that one, I think, is a little bit more. Um, it's 75 rated minimum. Then you can only have players from the same league, max 10. Uh, 10 max clubs, three na max nationalities. Um, I'll probably do this later. Um, you do get a relatively good pack. And to be honest, the daily challenges or, or these kind of SBCs that are popping up are not really terrible. Yes, they're untradeable, which is a pain in the ass. But I think that they're, they're relatively good value, to be fair. Um, realistically, like I say, player moments, any of them SBCs ones we're looking for. There is a lot of low ones as well. But we're going to give it a send. Let's see what we get. Let me know down below if you get anybody decent. Do you get a Hazard? Hazard would be the best, obviously. We will see. And we get a... I don't know what flair that is. We get Spanish. Oh, no. Left wing. It's Ansu Fati. So it is someone who I already actually have. Um, an 89, though, is pretty good. It does mean I can whack him into an SBC. Um, let's go and have a look. And I've got him in a Real Madrid kit. What am I doing? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I forgot I'm wearing that. It is one that I've got, unfortunately. Oh. Hold on a second. It does say I can... Wait, what? It says it's... Tra well, it, 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 it technically says it's tradable, but obviously we know different to that. It would be pretty sick if they made them tradable, but uh, I thought I may have got a glitch there. So we do get 150 if we was to discard, and we have got him untradable. Obviously, I think we've played a couple of games with him. I really didn't like this card, but I, I suppose it's okay. We are going to have a look then. We will have a look. I don't think I've got any other SBCs. This was always the problem with it. Unless I dropped him down into um, the duplicates to kind of get back, I could do an icon pack with him because I'm not putting him in anything else realistically. Let's just have a look and see what fodder. I'm pretty sure I don't have the fodder as of yet to do this. Um, I could be wrong, but I do need to do the 82 and 88 because Jovic yesterday was so expensive. Like genuinely, I did not expect him to be that expensive. I thought I may have had more. Realistically, we're not looking at 88s in this. We're not even looking at 84s if I can. Um... Let's just whack. Let's see where we're at then. Let's just whack all of the fodder because we do need, what, 50 chems still. We'll whack all that in. Let's just have a look and see what we've got and if we can actually 
potentially do an icon pack. I have got something of a series to do uh, for the icons, which I'm going to be bringing to you hopefully very, very soon. So that is obviously something to keep a look at. If you want to subscribe right now, definitely go down below. Uh, I feel like I'm probably going to have to discard this card um, and then get him back. I know I've got two uh, recoveries anyway, because I've got a few fodder, but realistically, I don't want to be going over my board with it just yet. Um, it's a shame though. It's a shame it weren't one of the hazards or anything like that. And if you are collecting this SBC is just genuinely not going to be worth it for you because it, it just, there's so many duplicates out there. And I'm just trying to figure out who I've got that I can obviously put in. Who's got a better version card going up to the higher rateds is never great because I, I don't particularly want to be giving up many of these if I can, unless they've got a better version. It's something that I always do, and, and if they do have a better version, I'll whack them in. But, but predominantly, a lot of these are relatively maxed out now, especially when it comes to the team of the seasons. Uh, Luis Alberto, I've got his team of the season, in fact, so that's pretty good. Uh, we don't have any higher versions of them. Have we got any 91s then? Madison doesn't have one. Slomani, Gertz doesn't. I think. Oh, we do We do have these. Let's have a look and see. Because uh, it's just a 50 chem as well that you want to make sure. We do have these sort of players, which I was holding on to. But we are going to full send um, the league SBCs over the next couple of days. I feel like that is all I'm going to be able to kind of muster up. Yes, I feel like that is it. But that is that 11 players. I wonder if that's enough. Let's have a look then. Let's just see because we do need the 50 chem. Obviously, we have got a team of the season or technically uh, an inform from big boy Fabio Fabinho right there. It's a shame he's never got a, a, a real better, better card. Let's just see. In fact, if we go with De Gea up here a second because then we can go get Onana in. We can then also try and put Tadic there. I'll figure out the chem in a second, but if we can... Oh, God, no, wrong one. If we can figure out the chem, we might be able to scrape it, to be honest. Let's just have a look. We've got 83 already. I'm putting in quite a few 90s there, so I can imagine this should tip it. That does tip it to 88. The question is, can we get anybody of a lower rating in there? Um, I'm quite happy to give up all that. Nothing's going above the boundaries for me. Um, let's have a look at some 83s. Obviously, Blint now would be a great choice being Dutch, we also have, I suppose, Ramsey and Quag could be quite good. Let's see if that... Oh, no, I've just got rid, I've just got rid of Alberto. It doesn't matter. But that does only take it to an 87, which means we could probably get a decent amount off this. So if we go like that and then we go Syrie, let's just get Luis Alberto. Because as you see there, we have got his 97, which is absolutely phenomenal. Um, and then let's have a look. So we can drop out... I'm sure I say, I'm sure we can drop out him. Can we drop out De Gea, potentially? No, we cannot. So, if we drop out uh, Rashika, Rashi I don't know how to pronounce his name. It doesn't doesn't matter that much. Um, let's just see if we could drop out Tadic. We could. Could we drop out Unana as well? We can. So, I'm just trying to think. Can we drop? We, we need to. We're really close to being able to drop out one of these. Can we get it back with an 85 over an 83? No. What about if we drop out the 90 instead? We're probably literally just gripping off from that then. So what about if we take out Fabinho? That's actually quite a smart move. Then we can drop out him. And could we drop out the right wing then? We can. I always hate doing this bit. So I feel like... Let's see if we can drop out Unana, in fact. We can't. So there we go. That's perfect. So if we can get now back you as a right back... We then get Unana in there. This should be pretty easy chem, I want to say. Because if we whack you there, we'll put him over there. We'll put De Gea where Tadic should be. We'll drop down you there. 52, 56, and Bob is your uncle. So we'll do it on this video. Obviously, with what I'm actually doing in terms of content for the icons, um, these will be repeated for the first episode. Um, but, hold on. No, 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 no. I've just realized what I'm doing. What am I doing? And Sufati. That could have been that could have been disastrous. I was kind of focusing on the icons there and I forgot about this guy. So he could replace De Gea, which is actually really nice. 
Could he replace that? No. So, yeah, no, we can replace him with there. And there we go. That's much better. So we've got Ansu Fati in there. He's kind of helped us with an icon. I've got an 89, 86, uh, or two 86s ready for the next one. And like I said, with what we're going to be doing on the kind of content for the icons, the first episode will kind of... It will showcase the icons that we've already got, and it's kind of like a starting series. Let's just send this one once we've put Ansu Fati in. Guaranteed SBC. I kind of thought it was going to be a bit of a bust, but who cares? We give it a go. I always like to give SBCs a go. It's made us get an 89 for this, and we've only gave up an 84 rated squad. What icon can we get next? I think this is my fifth or sixth. We get Italian. We get CDM. Oh, that's atrocious. We trade in an 89 for another 89, but he's ticked off the list for who we've got. Obviously, going forward now, we don't want to get any Gattusos. Hopefully, you did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe down below. We're going to be bringing more content as soon as we can. Like I said, the icon, hopefully, if I can get everything ready, will be ready for Monday. Um, so, obviously, tomorrow, and then we can go forward with that. You'll understand a little bit more. And I just thought it's something different, something to kind of get us going with these icon packs and also for the death of FIFA. It's, it's kind of like a little nice idea, and it kind of ties in with what potentially I can do out of field actually doing really well on that sale um, just because, obviously, there's this pack that everybody wants. Like I said, make sure you like and subscribe. Go follow Twitch down below and I'll see you all for the next one. Peace.